Hey, what's good to y'all? Big Zay Zay in the building. How y'all doing? Alright, so recently I was scrolling down my timeline and then I came across this old video of Miley Cyrus and Liam Hensworth at the red carpet where Miley starts feeling him a little bit then starts licking at his face, right? Just for Liam to tell her to stop and then she, I think she like pushes him away or some shit afterwards. And in the comments, a lot of people are in there saying things like how she needs to learn how to chill out in public settings. She needs to grow up and stop acting all wild and shit, right? Now, hey, hey, look, if that's the kind of vibe that you want your girl to be on, I can understand that. But for me, it's like this. If you want a girl who acts professional and calm and chill, then you might want to get with a girl who's like that. Like, I'm just saying, bro, you can't get with a wild chick and then think she's going to act like a nun when it's convenient. So, personally, I just don't think that there's really a reason for him to be annoyed at it because it's like, this is the kind of woman that you got with. It's like, bro, if I were to be dating Miley and then she fucking flashes her tits off to the, in public or some shit, I really can't even be upset about that because it's like, nigga, I know the kind of girl she is. Not only that, she's done it before. And here's the thing, I'm a little bit of a wild nigga myself. So, for any girl out there that I end up dating, you don't want to try this whole licking me in public shit because I will tongue kiss you right there in front of everybody. Like, y'all already take a pictures anyway, I'm going to give y'all something to take a picture of. Y'all going to remember this night. Hell, I'll do a girl one better. Hell, we can go off and sneak off to one of the bathrooms, get us a little quickie in, then I can come right back out and accept my reward. <laughs> Then we can pick up where we take off as soon as we get back home Because best believe when we get back home that ass is mine Like bro if I were to ever to get rich off this internet shit Whenever I do get into a relationship I'm trying to have the Johnny and Kiss of Sense thing going on if you know what I'm saying Like I'm trying to be in my 30s with my girl Still having sex in, in random places like teenagers And once again if you want to live more conservatively I understand that That is your prerogative and I actually respect you a lot for that but the point that I'm making is, you can't get with somebody that you know is wild and then expect them to stop being wild just because they got into a relationship with you. It just doesn't work. And I'm definitely not saying that there aren't some people that can like know how to just be wild whenever it's time to do it and be chill whenever they want them to. But in general, that's just not really how most people operate. With most people that you deal with, you're going to get one or the other. So just take that into consideration. And honestly, whenever I do, I low-key hope that the girl has a bit of an alternative style too. Because Loki, I want to fuck a girl while listening to some dark music. I'm talking about listening to some fucking Wicked Games by the weekend. Listen to some Deftones, especially the Deftones. Like, have y'all heard Chino Marino's voice? Like, the Deftones music just has so much sexual energy in there. It's gonna be at night too. Our moon sign's gonna be aligning like the TikTok filter. You feel me? Alright, that's enough for me for today. I'm out. Big Zay Zay gone.